Guards are on duty day and night at the Smithsonian's Natural History Museum. They're on the lookout for human thieves, but imagine a 10-legged bandit that's bold enough to steal things right from your home or campsite. Well, that's what our next weird animal does, the robber crab. Forget what you know about most crabs you see at the beach. These guys are way bigger, way weirder, and way stronger. They can be very powerful. They have very powerful claws, and they're known to lift up to uh, uh, 60 pounds of weight. Nearly three feet across, they're the largest land crabs in the world. Imagine a crab as big as a chihuahua with 10 legs. Some can live to see their 60th birthday. But the weirdest thing about them is their peculiar shoplifting habit. They swipe things from each other and from us if they get the chance. It's usually not our food they're after. They are known to go into houses and tents where people live, and they like to steal uh, shiny objects like silverware, pots, and pans. Even our sneakers. Experts aren't sure what the crabs do with their stolen treasures, but they do seem to like smelly things. They have been able to develop a nose, if you will. And these antennae here, they are uh, adapted to smell the air, and they have a very sharp sense of smell. One thing's for sure, robber crabs love to eat fruit, especially coconuts. That's why they're sometimes called coconut crabs. Not only can they climb coconut trees, but their massive claws can pick the fruit and split it open. With the help of their tips of their legs, which are very sharp, they can actually puncture a hole in the eyes of the coconuts. In other words, don't try picking up a robber crab with your bare hands. One final weird fact. The crabs live on islands in the Indian and West Pacific Oceans, but they can't swim. In fact, if they're submerged in water, they'll drown. 